Tyler Gothier, the man, the myth, the youper. <laughs> Check this out. I went with flannel this year. Is it, does it pull? It's like not traditional flannel, but it pulls my youper. That's the youper. Yeah. So, uh, so you came all the way down to Iola, Wisconsin today from Michigan, mm -hmm. the Upper Peninsula, and you did that entirely to race and get fourth place today. So congratulations on Thank your finish. You. you had some really, really fast guys you were up against, and you you held in there really well, finished uh, fourth. So how was it out there? Good. When you don't, the first race, it's all it's just a toss up. You're flipping a coin. Right. Who's going to be good? Who's not? Are you going to be trained? good? <laughs> but you come in, you come in just worrying about yourself. You can't worry about anybody else because you just don't know. So what's awesome is just to come here and soak in the sun, get back in the trend, uh, get with uh, get with the guys, see what's going on, see how the legs are. And so I'm really happy with it. We were one big group for a second lap, and then Joseph threw in a pretty big attack. And you have to you have to play your matches correct in the first race. And I decided not to go with it kind of settle in and then uh, me, Tristan and Corey decided to just team up and, and settle in and it worked for me. I got him on the back side knowing that coming into the pines you got to be in the right position and I'm really happy with it. Settled in really well and went well. Yeah, I know Joe uh, tends to uh, take some chances out on the course and see if it's going to if it's gonna work out for him to, to throw the attack down and, and I think uh, Nathan kind of hung in with him for the most part on that. Uh, so you decided to, to kind of play it safe a little bit more on yeah, that? Yeah, well, I, Joseph's a, a very aggressive rider, and it's how you become better, and I, I give him a lot of credit for that. It takes a lot of guts to do that. And, but you could see this year that all the attacks that he did last year is coming around this year. So sure. I, I kind of figured he was out front. He was going to do it. I didn't know when, and he went, and it was just a match I wasn't ready to burn. I figured first race, a lot of times people blow up and yep, come back. Absolutely. And I played that card. I thought maybe one or two of them would come back and we'd eventually, I had a strong group. I mean, anytime you're with Tristan and Corey, you can ride with those guys. Eventually you're going to pull someone back, but it didn't happen today. Right. And that's the chances you take, but that's the way she goes. Well, you know, uh, so far nobody, no no girl has photobombed your interview <laughs> like you did with uh, Ms. Cooper Dendo. They don't dare. Uh, what? <laughs> they don't dare. They don't dare. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, so you, you're going to take a little bit of credit for your teammate, uh, which rightfully so. You've you've helped her along. Yeah. Uh, d she's done really well. Uh, I think that she's going to do some really good things this year, and I think you're, you're going to be doing uh, some ma amazing races uh, this season as yeah, well. Yeah, so. I'm just really happy to see the Upper Peninsula be consistently represented, and it's the whole reason I brought the flannel in here, just to bring that <laughs> Uper power. Cooper being on top, me getting on the podium today, or one of the steps, just really excited to have some Uper pride and some Uper representation. All right, well, you know, congratulations thanks. again today. Uh, awesome race, and we will see you again at the next one. All right, thanks.